A Lakes Area Habitat for Humanity celebrated the completion of their 120th house for a local family in need. And this one was unique as it was a house that was in line to be demolished but was instead moved and refurbished for a deserving family. Our reporter Rachel Johnson has more. A house in Baxter was filled from front to back Monday with people celebrating a job well done. Today is the most important day of our entire program for the family, for our program, when we have the opportunity to bring together the community to showcase what serving families in need looks like and join together in celebration of their soon-to-be home that they'll own. Mandy Miller and Brian Andrews are officially homeowners. The whole time we would work on the house, we would just think about things that we would be able to do, you know, once you're finally in here. And so now we can just start being able to do those things. So that's pretty exciting. Lakes Area Habitat for Humanity was established in 1990 and works to provide affordable housing to families in need. There's a criteria list that we have, so the families have to take the first step and apply. And then we have a, a system of checking to make sure they meet our particular guidelines. And once we have those checked, then we actually visit them in their homes. This is the first of five houses that were moved when the city of Baxter needed to expand Cypress Drive. Instead of demolishing the five houses that were in the way of the road expansion, they reached out to Habitat for Humanity for help. This has been a very intriguing and very uh, unique experience. Um, the city reaching out to us, asking us to be their partners in helping save five homes from the wrecking ball. Mandy and Brian have dreamed of owning their own home after renting for years with their family of eight. The most exciting thing for us is like the fact that our kids are going to have space and area to just be able to play and just be kids. The Habitat crew is looking forward to the completion of the next house on the project, which will be right next door. They hope to have it ready for another deserving family by Christmas. Reporting from Baxter, Rachel Johnson, Lakeland News. And again, that's the 112th House for Habitat for Humanity, for Lakes Area Habitat for Humanity, which serves Cass, Crowing, and Hubbard Counties and the City of Staples. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.